In this video, I want to show you a free membership plugin for WordPress, so which with which you can create a different membership level. So for example, if you want to hide different content behind a paywall, for example, or if you want to offer different memberships on your website, then you can easily do this. So I have here um, a really good image that explains it very well. So you can offer, for example, uh, free memberships. If you, for example, have an um, online, uh, have an uh, have a chat function on your website and you want uh, that people register to participate into your into the chat room then you can do this as well and also you can um, create different membership levels where you charge different amounts for these different membership levels and yeah this is what I want to show you in this video so uh, then let's get started so let's get get to our website here and um, now we have to install a new plugin let's go to plugins add new plugin and then we are searching for simple membership. Oh, membership. Okay, and this is the plugin we are searching for. Then we are clicking on install now. And then of course we click on activate. And now the plugin is activated. Now you can see on the left side, we have a new option here, WP memberships. And then uh, first, what we have to do first, we have to create um, at least one membership level. So then let's do this. Let's click here. And now you can see at the moment, we don't have any membership levels. Then we click on add new and let's make this membership level, for example, or let's make this free. So I will call this membership level free but you can also call this premium or uh, I don't know, you can call it whatever you want. And now this is important um, default WordPress role that is uh, on subscriber because yeah, you can then um, have different uh, roles, user roles, but you have to leave it on subscriber. And here, for example, when you have a premium, a paid membership level, then you um, can set um, the expiration of this membership level. Um, for example, when you charge, uh, I don't know, $10 per month for the premium membership level, then you can set this on, uh, yeah, that it expires after one month. Um, but for now, for this free membership level, this free membership level, level is um, free forever. So I will uh, leave it on no expiry, then um, default account uh, status. So this we can uh, make it to active active. So when somebody um, register or buys a membership level from you, then you can um, put it to pending or um, yeah, but I will put it now on activate or active. Uh, email activation. So yeah, I want to have this and then I click on add new membership level. Okay. Now here you can see this is our new membership level, membership uh, level free subscriber. And this is important that you remember this, um, the ID. So for this uh, free membership, our ID is two. Then, um, Let's create a new site so that I can show you. So we go to pages and then we go to add new page, uh, open in a new tab, close this and call this page free membership site. This content is this free for example. And um, so now you can see um, here on the WP membership protection, here we can set the protection level. Uh, here you can see no, uh, don't protect this content. So not right now, everyone, everyone can access this page, or we can set it to yes, protect this page. And I want to do this. And then, um, yeah, I can choose the different uh, level. So if I had more levels, more membership level, then um, yeah, I could see this uh, membership level, but I only have one now. So I click on free and then I will click on publish and publish. Now let's go to with the page. Now you can see this is what the content looks like or the page looks like when we are not signed in as a member. Um, 
And here you can see when somebody wants to visit the website or the uh, specific page here, they can um, log in or they can click on join us and they will fill out the registration form. And the plugin um, has already created all necessary pages for us. Let me show you. you. Um, here you can see um, we have the registration or the join us. So uh, here's the join us page and here's the registration page, uh, member login, password reset and profile. These pages are created by the new plugin and you can now um, you can um, make a button on your website or make something like this here and then um, yeah link these buttons to the registration form and then they um, the potential member can can choose the membership level, pay for the membership level and then they can register. Uh, let me show you how this looks like. So uh, join us. For example, let me open this page and here you can see this is the pre-made join us uh, page. So of course you can um, fully customize this page, simply click on edit page and then you can customize this. Um, yeah, uh, right now here you can see we only have um, the free membership level. This is why we only have this and um, yeah, this is a button here. So we can fully customize it and you can, of course, um, make it look like this. You only you can build this, for example, and then simply link these buttons here to the different membership levels. Uh, this is uh, yeah, pretty easy, pre pretty straightforward. Or you will or you can customize, of course, um, this complete page here. Uh, yeah as automatically generated for you with some basic ideas how the join me page looks like. Yeah, this is not uh, perfect and you have to have to customize this. So then let me show you um, all the settings of this plugin. Um, let me go, let me show you first the members. Here you can see when somebody register on your website, then you can manage all the accounts. Uh, you can um, delete this. Uh, you can set the different membership levels if you want to, if you need to. Um, the emails, membership levels. Yeah, this, this is uh, at level manage content protection. Here you can see um, the roles, how this looks like, uh, a category protection when you have um, different categories. For example, this is here is an e-commerce store integrated, integrated, then you could also protect um, e-commerce um, category pages with this tool, or even if you want to hide uh, posts behind a paywall. So I think, yeah, you already saw this on different websites when you want to read a, a blog post and then you only see uh, the first few sentences and then, yeah, the, the page is locked or the content is locked behind the paywall. And this is exactly um, how they do it with something like this. Here you can see I only have this um, standard test post here, but then now I could lock this a post behind a paywall. Then let's go to settings. Here are different um, settings. So general settings. Uh, yeah, this is um, enable free membership. Of course, this is really important if you want to offer free membership. So I have to um, click this and here you can see the membership level idea. So um, I told you uh, before that we have to remember the number of the membership level. So the the number was two. Now the system knows exactly uh, which membership level is the free membership and um, enable more tech protection. Now we don't need this default account status. We don't need this. Um, okay, here after somebody makes a payment, um, then yeah, the account or the membership level will go to active. Uh, must locked into comment. Yeah, I think this is good. Uh, Log in form. Using link. Yeah. And here you can see also um, the URLs of the different pages that the plugin has created for us. Here you can see the login page URL, registration form page URL. And also here you can change this if you don't uh, like the looks of it or the, the URL, then the URL structure, then you can of course change this. 
yeah and uh of course this is uh yeah really good and this is completely free now we click on save changes and here you can see um we could also okay when you want to integrate uh go to new payment when you want to integrate the payment then you have to um enable the payments here paypal yeah here you can set up paypal and also stripe so if you want to integrate paypal or stripe as a payment method then you can do this here first yeah first before we can activate this we have to um fill in our um paypal or stripe credentials and then this function is enabled so that they can uh, pay with paypal or can pay with stripe i think this is really good you can manage everything from here then what this uh, create uh, here you have uh, new buttons or you can um yeah change the button or create new buttons okay this is perfect yeah and um i think that's it so now you know exactly how you can create um yeah without any hustle you can create membership uh, sites and lock uh, different content or different pages behind a paywall and yeah create really cool membership websites if you have a course for example or if you uh, yeah want to hide uh, different content behind the paywall then you can use this plugin this plugin is really good so yeah i think that's it for the video so if you found this video informative then i would appreciate if you press the thumbs up button and also please subscribe to my youtube channel and also if you have any questions then let me know in the comments down below i will answer your questions as soon as i can and yeah for then thank you very much for your time thank you for watching and see you in the next video bye